Hello and welcome to the video Install Adobe Database in Windows 10 Operating System Through this video, I will guide you how to install and set up Adobe Database in Windows 10 with the following steps uh, Download Adobe Distribution uh, Set up the Adobe underscore home system environment variable And uh, run the IJ2 uh, command line tool that is used uh, to manage Adobe Database And how to start Adobe Network Server First, uh, we need to download a distribution of the B database from its uh, official website, its uh, home page. So head over to the DB database home page at this URL, uh, db.apache.org slash db. And you see this is home page of uh, Apache DB database, a pure Java uh, database engine. And uh, I will download the latest version of uh, the B database uh, version 10.15.2.0 here for Java 9 and higher. So click this link and choose to download from the suggested uh, mirror site. And you can see there are several many directories here, and we go into the uh, DB DB directory here. and go in the DB directory and go into the DB version 10.15 and uh, for installing uh, the B database on Windows 10 operating system uh, we should download the binary distribution so click to download this uh, file uh, DB uh, version 10.15.2.0 bin.zip here this is a binary distribution of the B database and choose to save the zip archive in a directory on a computer so I create a new directory in the B here click save done the download complete and click here to show in a folder and you see this is a zip archive, is a binary distribution of the B database. Yeah, and we extract this zip archive file. So extract here. And we got the extracted directory for the B database here. And you can see the bin directory contains uh, the script files uh, for setup environment variables. Uh, running the uh, B in uh, embedded mode or in network mode start the IJ2 start stop the network server and demo directory contains the uh, demo programs uh, demo code uh, documentation java doc uh, and the lib directory contains the jar files uh, that are the uh, runtime of uh, the B database and for developing Java applications uh, using uh, the B database, we need to use uh, the jar files here. And I recommend you to set up the db underscore home system environment variable. So you will be able to use the db tools everywhere in the command uh, prompt. So open the environment system environment variables dialog here uh, environment variables and under the system variables uh, create a new uh, system variable name is uh, the underscore home and uh, value is uh, uh, directory here so I copy the part of the db installation directory okay and then we update the part environment variable to include the bin directory of the db home so we wrap the uh, db underscore home inside uh, percent size and slash bin okay that's it to set up the environment variables for the uh, b database and uh, the home and update the part environment variable to include the part to the bin directory of the uh, uh, B home 
Yeah. Okay. And now we can open the Windows command prompt to uh, create a uh, the database. Uh, so open a, a new window uh, command prompt here, and uh, choose as a directory you want to create a new the database. For example, I want to go to the G driver. Uh, go to uh, Debbie and this is a uh, uh, Debbie installation directory and uh, now from the command prompt you can type the IJ command to use the command to IJ and you can see we are in in the IJ2 you can see IJ version 10.15 here and from this uh, IJ2 we can create a new uh, M embedded the database so type this command connect uh, followed by a jdbc url jdbc colon the uh, b colon and then the database name for example um, mydb and to create a new database uh, we need to specify this attribute create equal to and uh, enter to execute this command and it returns silently that means it has created successfully the new database mydb in the directory in the current directory so we can check uh, sorry we need to uh, type exit to quit uh, ij2 here And you can see the directory my uh, db got created here. And this is a directory for the uh, w database in which we have created uh, so far. And see in the Windows Explorer, and you can see the directory my db got created here. And you can see uh, uh, under this directory there are directories and files of a uh, uh, w database. So by setting uh, system environment variables for the B, you can use the IJ2 anywhere in the command prompt. And also start the, the B uh, database network server. Uh, you can see in the, the B installation directory, in the bin directory, there are several uh, script files here. You can see IJ here yeah, um, set network clan cp network server cp start network server stop network server so in the command prompt you can type the names of this uh, script files to uh, uh, execute them for example i want to start the the B network database server uh, from this uh, directory so i can type uh, start uh, network server and you can see uh, the B, uh, database network server prints some information here you can see Apache W network server version 10.15.2.0 here and you can type press ctrl c to terminate the server process that's how to download, install and configure the B database in a Windows 10 operating system. I hope you have found this video helpful. Please subscribe to my channel and then like, comment and share this video. Thanks for watching.